Hello, I quickly want to show you the website I've built uh, last week. Uh, you can upload HTML5 apps and games and it will convert it to uh, an Android app and later uh, iOS as well. Uh, it uses capacitor and it does that uh, all on the cloud. So we just have to upload a few files and it will build the whole app for us. So we will just get started with an example. So we make a new folder my app or my game or whatever open it with uh, Visual Studio Code we have to have a www folder and the index.html file that's the requirements so we will really quickly make a simple app just hello from my new app okay that's it now we have to convert it to a zip file so www send to zip now inside that zip you have to make sure that you have the www folder and the index uh, file then let's go to the website first of all we have to log in via github let's do that really quickly Okay, now I'm logged in. I will choose that file. D -d 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 PC, desktop, scrolling down, uh, my app, then here W folder, the zip file, upload it. Then it says the file is being processed. Now we can uh, manually uh, click uh, get status to see the status of all our builds this is the ID of the current build I just have to click uh, refreshing to see uh, where it is now it says pending now let's see still pending it's waiting for a server to be free normally that takes like 20 seconds so now it is running now it will take about three or four minutes for it to build and if it is building successfully you can then download it here so to uh, instead of waiting I will switch to my phone and download the app directly on my phone and install it there and see if it worked Okay, so now I'm on my phone and I will just get the status. Oh yes, it has been built successfully. It took just about two minutes. Now uh, I have the, the build which I can download. I quickly click on download. Then I open the files app. Click on downloads. I see the app top zip file. I will extract that app and at the same time deleting the zip file because I don't need it anymore. Okay, then I have the app dash debug.apk which I can now install. Yes, I want to install it. Let's click here uh, install anyway. Then the app was successfully installed. And we don't want to send uh, it for scanning. And then if we go to our apps, it is here. It's called uh, app name. We click on it and we will see hello from my new app. So that's pretty cool, pretty basic. I will, of course, uh, improve that. Make it uh, compatible with uh, plugins. And thanks for watching.